Hello, little friends from Ajuka Flicks Kids. Today, we're going on a super special adventure to meet a real science superhero named Stephen Hawking. He was born a long time ago, on January 8, 1942, in a city called Oxford in England. Did you know that day was extra special? It was exactly 300 years after another amazing scientist named Galileo had left the world. It was almost like Stephen was destined to become a great explorer of the stars. When Stephen was a little boy, he was super, super curious. He loved staring at the night sky, watching the stars sparkle like tiny bits of magic. He would wonder, what are those bright lights? How does the universe work? How did everything begin? He wanted to find all the answers, like a galaxy detective. Stephen also loved playing with toy trains and making up fun games with his friends. He and his family even built a wooden toy airplane together to pretend they were flying. But what he loved most was reading books about space and dreaming of the day he could uncover the universe's secrets. He'd tell his friends, one day I'll understand everything about the stars and space. When Stephen grew up, he went to a very important school called the University of Cambridge. There, he started learning amazing things about space and the universe. He became really interested in black holes, which are like giant vacuum cleaners in space. Did you know black holes are so strong that they even suck in light? That's why we can't see them. Ah. Stephen wanted to understand how they worked and what happened mm. inside them. But little friends, Stephen faced a big challenge in his life. When he was 21 years old, doctors found out he had a disease called ALS, which made his body very weak. Mm. Over time, he needed a wheelchair to move around because his legs and arms didn't work like they used to. Later, he also lost his voice and had to use a special computer to talk. The computer turned his words into a voice so he could still chat with everyone. Even with this challenge, Stephen never ever gave up on his dreams. He would say, no matter what happens, always look up at the stars, not down at your feet. Stephen used his brilliant mind to come up with ideas that no one had ever thought of before. He discovered magical things about black holes, like how they can release a special energy called Hawking radiation. He also studied the Big Bang, which was like a huge explosion that happened billions of years ago and created the universe with all the stars, planets, and even us. His ideas were so incredible that other scientists were amazed. Stephen Hawking became one of the most famous scientists in the whole world. He wrote awesome books, like A Brief History of Time, which even grown-ups thought was super cool because it explained the universe in a way everyone could understand. He also appeared on TV shows and even in cartoons, like The Simpsons, Show! where he made kids laugh and learn at the same time. Stephen showed the world that even with challenges, we can dream big and do wonderful things. He taught us that the most important thing is to never stop asking questions and being curious. Stephen left us in 2018, but his ideas still shine like stars in the sky. Today, scientists still use his discoveries to learn more about space and the universe. So little friends, the next time you look up at the night sky and see a twinkling star, think of Stephen Hawking. He showed us that curiosity can take us to amazing places and we should never stop asking why. Hmm. Who knows? Maybe you'll become a great universe explorer just like him. Until our next adventure here on EducaFlix Kids, where we always discover new and magical things to learn and have fun together. See you soon. <laughs>